finally here. I think we're in a good place, which is good, right? <laughs> yeah. Until you told me about what your next video is going to be on, and I'm feeling a lot of angst about that. I, so I'm, I think it'd be fun. Bear with me. I think it'd be fun if I... I want to talk about systematic desensitization, like how do you overcome a phobia? So I could just talk about that, but that'd be kind of boring. Or I could go buy a tarantula and make Allison overcome her spider phobia for the YouTube channel. I, I feel like I'm normal phobic to spiders. I don't like them. So this will be an easy, this will be an easy for you. I am big time phobic to tarantulas. That is a hairy spider. It's basically a, a dog. Let me give you some context. A couple months ago, I found a black widow in my garage, and I thought this would be a great opportunity to do a video about systematic desensitization. I'll talk about spider phobias and walk you through the steps that people take to overcome their fears. The problem is I can't hold a black widow spider. So the video, I recorded a video and it just, it just didn't work. I never put it out. That's a bad dude, right? If you have a phobia, there's kind of two ways to deal with it. One strategy is to be flooded. That means if you're afraid of snakes, you jump into a pit with a thousand snakes, you'll have a panic attack, you freak out, and then eventually your body can't keep up that rate of anxiety and eventually you will return back to normal and at that point you won't be afraid of the snakes anymore. A much more common strategy is systematic desensitization. And what that means is you pick whatever the subject of your phobia is and you progressively expose yourself to it. And if you spend enough time with the animal, you are able to touch the animal, pick the animal up, etc. Now, that doesn't mean be stupid. I'm not going to pick up a black widow. Now, how boring is that? Just me looking at a spider through a cup? You need the real deal. This is a really cool tarantula. Where is it? Let me see it. It's right here. Can you see it? Oh my gosh. All right, ready. All right you ready? Ready to go? Yes. Let's see what, let's see what mom says. The plan was to desensitize Allison. I wanted to get her so used to the tarantula that she was able to pick it up and put it on her head. That was my sort of long-term vision. The problem was, in order for me to walk her through that process, I had to be able to hold the tarantula as well. And I freaking hate spiders. So the first night, I scared her with the spider, and then after everybody went to bed, I walked downstairs and had to get comfortable with the tarantula. The closer I get to doing this, the stupider <laughs> this seems. I think I'm probably more afraid of spiders than my wife. So I, so I gotta get used to this damn thing before tomorrow. Let me bring this camera here so you can see. So this is, this to me, I think, is a, this is a small tarantula, right? What's there to be afraid of? This thing freaks me out. Close, like right now I'm pretty nervous. But if I just force myself to stay near, like stay this close to the tarantula, my anxiety will eventually drop. Oh boy. See, that scares me, is the thing. The idea is to keep your anxiety in a place where you are uncomfortable, but not totally panicked. And so that's kind of right where I'm at right now. On a scale of 1 to 10, I'm probably at a 7. Whoa, I did not know he could do that. Jeez. You got sticky legs, I guess. I'm just going to push him back in here until I calm down a little bit. <laughs> I'm freaked out. <laughs> so right now, like I said, I'm doing okay. But when he, when he started 
crawling over the top, it makes me nervous. My anxiety jumps a little bit. So I just want to get used to what that looks like. And then hopefully I can, this is another way for me to freak out a little bit, but he's far enough away from me that I'm not gonna. Let me stop you for one second. Please, if you would, hit the like button. It's really good for the YouTube algorithm. And come on, I'm gonna touch a tarantula here. Let's see if I've got my hand. So I did it. It was hard, but I did it. I was proud of myself. I felt like smooth sailing. I got used to the spider. Surely the next day's work with Allison would be no problem. So I used that spider and we tried to desensitize her, uh, but it did not go off without a hitch. It was much more difficult than I thought and we did not get the outcome we were looking for. So I will post that video tomorrow. So look out for it. This, did you this, actually touch it when you went in there? You touched I his butt. It. But you touched oh, right his butt. Now? Watch. I didn't do it. I <laughs> Thank you so much for your time. If you haven't already, please hit the like button and subscribe. <laughs>